The Attorney General has singled out Townsville as a juvenile crime hotspot in addressing the Queensland Parliament this afternoon. The government also voiced plans to introduce mandatory boot camp for juveniles that continue to steal cars. Day one back in business, the Attorney General officially put forward amendments to the Youth Justice Act. The bill amends the Youth Justices Act to provide for the publication of identifying information about repeat offenders who are the subject of court proceedings. If it's given assent, juveniles' criminal history will also be made available in adult courts. Detention as a last resort will be removed and breaching bail will become an offence, landing juveniles in jail for up to a year. Local campaigner Terrell Parkinson was flown to Brisbane for the amendment's introduction. They have to be able to get back into the community and become productive members of the community. We can't have them going on to adulthood doing this sort of crime. The government estimates it will take 90 youths off the street each year by sending car thieves with two convictions in 12 months straight to boot camp. To get these young people to turn their lives around, get them a job and an education and out of a life of crime. Just last night, a 16-year-old girl attempted to carjack a woman near Smithfield Shopping Centre in the far north. The youth was arrested one kilometre from the scene. It's not surprising at all to police. We deal with a lot of uh, offenders of that age and, and in some cases even younger. Uh, it's not, not unusual, it's, it's a sad fact. The reforms will now be considered. Rosanna Kingson, Wynn News.